This is North America's porcupine, Arethazon dorsatum. It's a pretty large rodent. It's our second largest rodent. This one, it looks to be a female. We ran into her in Nebraska. She weighs in probably about 20 pounds. Here you get a look at how she moves. In Texas, the porcupine is found only in the western portions of the state. The Panhandle, parts of the Trans-Pecos, and parts of the Hill Country. In North America, they're widespread with the exception of the southeastern part of the country. Porcupines are described as angry animals by some. Well, that's kind of strange um, given my experiences. When I've run into porcupines in the field, and even when we conducted a research study on porcupines, I found them to be pretty passive animals that would much rather be away from you up a tree or in a hole somewhere. Porcupines um, are born with modified hairs called quills. And these are initially soft and hardened shortly after birth. They are used in defensive behavior. Quills are not shot. They are nothing more than hairs. So when they come in contact with the predator, the predator is stuck with them. And when the predator jerks back, it actually pulls a quill out of the porcupine, similar to having your hair ripped out. They are herbivores, and they feed on several different types of plants. Um, one good sign to look for in the field if you're looking to see if there's a porcupine nearby is to look for trees that have bark missing or that is, for the most part, stripped off of the tree. This is a good sign that porcupines have been feeding.